Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Javier, and you're watching Retire, Recharge, and Realm. And we wanted to bring you along with us. We attended an EV show in VNTN Capital, which I thought was pretty interesting. There was a pretty amazing variety of vehicles on display, different uh, bearing capabilities at different price points. So I thought that was interesting and really just also that's what I thought was interesting is the um, uh, point to which uh, the country and the government of Laos are going to really incentivize um, people to migrate to electric vehicles. You see this a lot now, uh, both electric bikes and electric uh, via, uh, cars and trucks um, you see quite a few on the road i think a couple reasons i think is the motivation or one is to reduce the dependence on the imported fuel and also i think just to drive more sustainability within the country so up on the right we are approaching vntn center and you'll see the ubiquitous food panda mascot there looking down on us. So this is, for my friends in America, this Food Panda is kind of like uh, Uber Eats or uh, uh, like a Grab from Thailand, where you can order food uh, online or through your phone and have it delivered, so pretty convenient. So the first manufacturer we're walking up to is BYD. Uh, so BYD is one of the larger manufacturers from China. They've got a pretty wide variety of vehicles, uh, all electric vehicles. Uh, this one we're walking up to is the uh, BYD Addo 3. So this is a compact SUV type vehicle. And I believe the range on this was at 480 kilometers uh, with the price right in the mid 30s US. Uh, the prices you'll see today are, were those quoted during the road show, but I think they're probably pretty accurate within a range. Uh, so this would give you an idea of what's available here and at what price. So this next manufacturer is JMEV. They've got a GSC 400 kilometer range at 27,000, and this is a 500 kilometer range vehicle at 30,000 US. The next vehicle coming up is a compact GMEV. So this is the EV2 here, this kind of neon green vehicle uh, at 13,000 US. And then just right down from it is the EV3, 300 kilometer range at 14,000 US. I think you're already seeing the, the kind of range and affordability uh, price options here and different capabilities. So this one here is the Ceres. This is a different manufacturer. So this is the Ceres S. And this was uh, 635 kilometers at 48,000 US. And then right next to it is a plug-in hybrid. I believe it was the mid 40s miles per gallon, uh, but I don't have the price on this one. So I believe it was probably just a little bit less than than the Series S. Okay, um, now we're walking down past the Sarah's vehicles. On the left here, we've got vehicles from Dongfeng. This is a Chinese manufacturer. This is an all-electric pickup truck. Yes, uh, kilometers, 350 kilometers at 33,000 US. And then you've got a crossover vehicle here. So this is a 550 kilometer range at 60,000 US. And then finally, you've got a compact vehicle, 200 kilometer range at 18,000 US. So again, see a pretty wide range of uh, capabilities and different price points. So here you've got the Wu Ling Xingsheng Hybrid, 20,000 at 40 miles per gallon. You've got the Baojun Yundo, uh, 360 kilometer range at 25,000 thereabouts. 
And then this is the Baojun Yep EV, 300 kilometer range at 17,800. I thought that was a neat little vehicle. You've got the Wuling Mini for 9,800, 170 kilometers, and the Wuling Bingo for 18,000 at 200 kilometer range. And now you've got the Radar RD6 100% EV pickups. So again, the second uh, EV pickup uh, vehicle that we've seen here. This one has two different models. Uh, one is a 410 kilometer at 29,000 US, and there's a 550 kilometer range at 39,000 US. And then you'll see different color options here. So again, yeah, pretty interesting to see the wide variety of vehicles available at different price points. Uh, you see the, a huge migration to uh, EV and Laos, and yeah, it's yeah, very interesting. So hope you enjoyed this short video on electric vehicles in the country of Laos. Please like and subscribe, and we will see you in the next video. Uh, video. Thank you.